Thank, Thank goodness. goodness. <laughs> um, I'm not sure. What, go on. In. No. No deal. Edison Cavani in. I don't want to play the game. <laughs> um, the window is probably 95% shut for us. I know there are hours left of it. But um, the answer will be no to probably, I'm guessing, the players that you're saying. Um, in that case, Giroud out. Still. You expected that game to go longer, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying, I get it. Olivia Giroud out. Deal or no deal? No. no. Is he happy with that? Olivier Giroud in this window has been incredible as a professional and as a man. And uh, we all know that there's been interest and I sat here every, um, every press conference and said if it's right for Olivier, for myself, for the club, um, and he's been impeccable in that period. Um, and I've got huge respect for him for that and as a player. And the answer again is no. As in, will he leave? No. Has he trained today? Yes. And no problems as well? No. Any, any ins or outs, do you think, as well? I know you said most confidence. No, that's, that's what I'm saying. And, and the no ins means no outs. And what about uh, Tammy Abraham? Just my final question with you. How's his Yeah, he's um, trained today um, and felt OK. We need to see if there's a reaction because it was a, it's a pain injury. There's a lot of pain. And even in training, he has pain. So I'm going to look at that one overnight and, and test him in the morning. But he did get out there today, which is a positive, I suppose, in the longer term. Thank you. John? How would you sum up this transfer window then, Frank, if, if nobody does come in? Has it been a frustrating period for you? I don't want to say frustrating because I'm very aware of how football is and, um, and some things you know, are not in my control. My first thought was always what happens on the training pitch. Um, it's clear we wanted to bring players in. I certainly wanted to bring players in. I think I've made that pretty clear over the last few weeks and it hasn't happened. With Olivier Giroud, you say his attitude has been great this month. Is it now your job to try and get the best out of it because you must be disappointed so far with what, with what you've had. Yeah, it's my job with all the players to try and get the best out of them and you know, and the way I want us to play and things I need to see out of each position, each player and buying into what we're trying to do because that's important is key across the board, not just with Oli. Why do you think it hasn't worked so far? Because I presume you had higher expectations when you came. Of? Of Giroud. I'm not going to go in. I'm, I don't need to go into any of that. Um, looking at tomorrow's game, you're up against Brendan Rodgers. Mm. Um, what's the relationship like with him? Is he, does it go back quite a long way? So your dad was with him yeah. a couple of clubs as well. Yeah, he was. And um, my personal relationship more is from here. And he worked, obviously, over in the academy. Uh, I've kept in contact to a degree, not so much in recent years, but whenever I see him, obviously, we have good conversations. Huge respect for him. Um, how he's worked his way from this academy. This academy produces not just players, it produces coaches. We can see that on the first team staff. And he's a great example of that. What do you remember of him when he was here? Did you actually, did you see him and think actually yeah, he's got? He's got yeah, he stuck out. He stuck out for his knowledge, for his thirst for knowledge. He was sort of already learning different languages, and I, you know, it sounds a simple thing, but I could see that he, he wanted to do that football related to see how he could uh, open up um, his, his his thought process, and it was clear that he had that on, on the training pitch as well. From a from a Leicester City point of view, and actually from a player's point of view, how difficult is it when you have such a big disappointment? that they've just had at Villa, to then try and get over that and go again a few days later. can go either way. can go either way. can inspire or it can stay in the, in the mind for a bit. We can't, we can't assume either. We have to worry about ourselves. And what injuries, any injuries, new injuries tomorrow? What's the uh, situation? Uh, no, no injuries, no.